Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I've got a box from King Cole. So this is the new yarn from King Cole this month and I'm going to open this up. And we'll see. Ooh. We'll see what we've got. Mutley patiently waiting on this box. But I might keep this one to put my calf stuff in. <laughs> so you get a beautiful thank you card. Oh, I'm trying to hold that down with that sticky label. <laughs> I don't think it will stick. Nice thank you card. Let's see what we've got. Oh, so we've got this beautiful thank you. A bag. Oh, another pen. Put that in my crochet bag. There's another Kenko shopper bag. I gave the last one that I got to my sister Sandra, and she loves it. She loves it. So we've got a Kinko shopper bag. You can get them online as well. Now Kinko supply other places for yarn. But if you go, ooh, <laughs> chocolate, chocolate. One, two, three, four, five. One a day. <laughs> That'll do me for five days. A little bag of chocolate. Brilliant. It's so yummy as well. It's really tasty chocolate. Oh, what badge have we got this to? Kinko. I love crochet. Keep that. There is a little note, I think. So this is called Jitterbug. Eight brightly coloured 1980s retro inspired shades. Perfect for garments and accessories. Brilliant. I'm going to pop that aside. There's actually a pattern book. Anything else in here? I hope it's a crochet pattern book. Oh, it looks like a knitting pattern book. Oh, it's double knitting. Crochet, crochet, please. Oh, it's lots of different patterns. There's a double knit. That's nice. So there's a knitting pattern. Another knitting pattern. That's pretty, isn't it? An adult one. I can knit. I just prefer crochet. That one's nice. I'll just check that they are knitting. Yep. Because sometimes it will say double knit, but that's just the wool. Or the yarn. But these patterns are all for cancer. That's nice. I like that. Oh, that's another one of that same one. That the same one. No, it's not. It's different. That is brilliant. I like the hat. And I like that. Nothing. So I've got some patterns. I'll pop them there. Now, let's see what this jitterbug looks like. Oh, and I love knitting. So we'll open this up. I'm going to do it carefully because this paper is good for crafting. I've started a new craft. I've been doing... I've been doing resin pouring using UV and normal resin, liquid resin.
And I actually tried to put my crochet in it, but I got a lot of hole. I got a lot of bubbles. I'll show you this. I put a piece of my crochet in a couple of weeks ago. And I showed it in a, I've got some air bubbles in it. It kind of changed the yarn because it's acrylic. And then one of my friends told me to try cotton. She says, try it again with cotton. And I'm going to do that. I'm going to try another one with some cotton yarn. So let's see if this is the... Oh, look at this jitterbug. Oh. Oh, back this time. The last time I got one of each colour. Oh, look at that. Double knitting. That is so pretty. So pretty. What colour is this one? Uh, this one is Boogie. Boogie, Boogie, Boogie. Oh, if it's the 80s, it's going to be like, Yes, sir, I can boogie. This will boogie. That is really nice. I like that. It's 100 grams. Going to be acrylic. I love this bag. It's good for crafting this as well. <laughs> oh, it's nice and soft. I love the colours. Look at that. Was the jitterbug around in the 80s? I thought the jitterbug was earlier than the 80s. The jitterbug is a dance. So it's a hundred grams. It's a weight three if you're in the USA. It's double knitting if you're in the UK. This one is called Boogie. The number is 5464. It doesn't tell you what the yard is. Oh, there it is there. 306 yards, 280 meters, 100% premium acrylic. Use a 4 millimeter hook or needle that is a US 6. Beautiful. I can make myself something with that. I've got enough to make myself something. But the thing is though, on my channel, it always seems to be the blankets that get the most views. So what is this one? Oh, another big pack. Let's just rip it up like a parcel. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I like that one. Oh, I like that. This one is Whisper. Careless Whispers. Whisper. Joe, you know, I don't think it's anything to do. It could be to do with dances. I don't know. And it's the same. It's double knitting. Weight three. Let's see how many... So it's weight three, that's double knitting in the UK. It's 306 yards, 280 meters, 100% premium acrylic. And we'll open this up. Oh, this is really nice. It's really cold here at the moment. I feel a nice poncho or something coming on. I'm going to make my granddaughter a poncho with this. And she's nearly walking as well. She's taking her first few steps. She crawls as fast as you don't know what. She's really quick on her feet. Or her knees, I should say, <laughs> for crawling. She's really growing up fast. And it's going to be her birthday soon as well. So I might be making her something with that for her birthday. That is so pretty and it's really soft as well. 
Oh, it smells so nice. I don't know why we do that. Why do we do that? Tell me in the comments. Why? If you're out buying yarn or wool, why do you smell it? I mean, have you found a, a yarn that was really pretty? Do you think if you smell it and it didn't smell nice, it would put you off buying it? Sometimes it's just the manufacturing oils and things. Now, we've got one more. Will I give the box to Motley? He needs his toy. I'll take that sticky label off first. Oops. Motley, do you want a box? Motley, are you wanting a box? Oh, there you are. Ah, oh, did you hear the box? Do you want it? Do you want it? Do you want the box? Yeah? Do you want it? <laughs> Do you want it? Ask for it. <coughs> yeah, you want the box. Do you want it? Do you want it? <coughs> yes, you want the box. There you go. Right, we'll put your ball in the box. So, this is the ball that Motley's got. You can see him just down there in that corner. Look at the mess on the floor he's got. There he is. Oh, are you peeping round the corner? In the box. Oh, where is it? Oh, there you go. Where's the box? And that's what he does. He just plays with these boxes, puts his toys in them. Are you going to have fun? <laughs> he doesn't eat them, honestly, he doesn't eat them. He doesn't eat them, he just chews them up a bit, <laughs> pulls them to pieces. And then he leaves it just all on the floor for me to pick up. Now, this is the last one. Oh, that is really pretty. Look at this one. Do you know, this one looks like different colours. There's a little paper. Is that a little mix of all the other ones? Now one is called Go Go. Oh, it is. Right. We'll open this one up. So we've got a full pack of the one that's called Whisper. One that's called Boogie. And then these ones. Look at these. This one. Now there's eight in this range. That's a whisper one. So that's the same as that one. And there's going to be a boogie woogie there. It's there. There's a boogie. So that gives me an extra one for the whisper and an extra one for the boogie. This one. Oh, I like the colours in that. Look at those colours. And they're all different shades as well. That's such a beautiful mix of colour. And that's kind of what they're hoping it's going to look like when it's all either crocheted or knitted. This one is called Sunshine. The number is 5467. And they're all double knitting. So that makes them all a weight 3. They're all 100 gram balls. It's all 100, it's all 100% premium acrylic and they all have 306 yards or 280 metres in them. So that one is called Sunshine and the number is 5467. This one is Boogie, 5464. And this one is Whisper 5463. Just in case you want to write these down, because what you do is you go on you go on to Google and you'll type it and you'll see all the people that provide this. 
Because King Cole, that is beautiful. This one is dancing. We're dancing, we're dancing, we're... You know, you do that to my to my granddaughter. If you say, we're dancing, we're... And she just dances away. She gets up and she claps her hands and she dances. My daughter's always saying, we're dancing, we're dancing. So this one is called Dancing. And I've got to make my granddaughter something with that one. Definitely a nice warm hat. I'll do it a nice, really warm hat. And this is shade 5462. I'm going to leave that aside because I have got a hat in mind for Abby. I'll pop that to the side. And that can be a dancing hat. This one is called Wham. And the number for this is 5466. That is beautiful. Look at the colours in that. Now, even one ball, one ball will make a pair of gloves, make a hat, make a small scarf, make a dog coat. Now, this one is called Freedom. A lot of it's to do with Wham, isn't it? But Wham, Freedom. Maybe not. <laughs> so, this one's called Freedom. Five, four, six, five. That is beautiful. I like the colours in that. Do you know what? You can mix and match these as well because they've all got sort of matching sort of shades. If you do a blanket, you can do so much in that, so much in that. And then this one. Look at this one. This is beautiful. Do you know, my friend Liz is going to absolutely love these. Liz Fox does a lot of... <laughs> Molly's, Molly's got yourself in the box and just fell back out of it <laughs> my friend Liz Fox she does a lot of mosaic crochet and she does a lot with a light colour and she loves this kind of stuff to go in between it this one is called Tropicana right Wham Sang Tropicana Club Tropicana drinks are free I want my freedom we've got Wham Careless Whisper, that one's Whisper. Ooh, I'm getting a Wham theme coming here. Boogie, did they do anything to do with Boogie? Or George Michael? Sunshine, don't blame it on the moonlight. That's not him. And then we have Go-Go, wake me up before you Go-Go. They're all Wham inspired. Well, I think they are. I wonder if they even realise that. So we've got a go, go I like that. So the number for this is 5460. So you've got go, go Club Tropic. We've got Tropicana. We have Wham. And they did actually have a song. Wham, bam. That one, whatever it is. Freedom. I was never a Wham fan, actually. And Whisper. Boogie. They must have something to do with Boogie. One, two, three, and the dancing. Did they do one to do with Boogie and one to do with dancing? Let me know. Let me know in the comments. I don't, These are amazing colours. Look, I could put those two together. I could put those two there together. That one's got quite a bit of blue as well. Brilliant. I'm go definitely going to use that dancing one for Abby. I'm definitely going to do that. That might be my next video for crochet. I'm going to find a nice stitch and do something. We're dancing, we're dancing. Nope. So that's it. These are the eight colours that... They have brought out in their jitterbug range. So thank you very much for watching. If you want any of the jitterbug, then just go onto Google, type in King Cole jitterbug and you'll find stockists all over the country. And I'm sure it is available in the USA as well. 
So thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to the channel. It's completely free to subscribe to the channel. And if you click on the bell icon, YouTube will tell you when I put up another tutorial. So until the next time, happy crafting and I'll see you all again soon. Goodbye.